Well, a fairly complex weather pattern is setting up for the next couple of days. It's going to keep rain and snow showers moving through Montana. As we go inside the forecast, there's this big upper level low, which is ultimately going to be diving to the south and strengthening here. We're going to be, see this big trough of low pressure to develop, and that's going to allow some pretty chilly air to dive south, I think, later this week. Looking at future track, you're going to see some rain and snow showers moving from west to east here this evening and overnight. Uh, again, we're not going to see a lot of rain or snow east of the divide because everything is coming from due west and that for us east of the mountains creates a, a down sloping flow and so we dry out once you get to about I-15 not expecting much in the way of any rain or snow here overnight very low chance of seeing a shower as we go into uh, Wednesday. Late Wednesday, there could be an isolated rain shower or mountain snow shower, but the bottom line is here, most of the rain and snow that we get in the next couple of days, it's mainly going to be western and southern Montana. You've got to go up in elevation to get snow. Lower elevations, it's going to be a chilly rain. I think east of the divide, once you get out over to the plains of north central Montana, it is mainly going to be dry. In fact, a lot of you will see sunshine as we go into the day on Wednesday. Temperatures feeling like fall out there. Highs in the 50s, lows in the 30s. Of course, you can download our Storm Tracker weather app for the most up-to-date forecast anywhere you go.